in this video we learn about mode of binomial distribution first we write the definition of binomial distribution the probability mass function of binomial distribution is given by probability of x is equals to x is equals to p of x it is equals to n c x p power x q power n minus x if x greater than x is equals to 0 1 2 3 and so on n zero otherwise observe that this is the probability mass function p of x is equals to probability of capital x is equals to small x it is equals to n c x p power x q power n minus x now let us consider p of x divided by p of x minus 1 let us consider p of x divided by p of x minus 1 what is p of x n c x p power x q power n minus x what is p of x minus 1 n c x minus 1 p power x minus 1 q power n minus of x minus 1 q power n minus of x minus 1 so you get n minus x plus 1 what is n c x n factorial by n minus x factorial into x factorial here in the denominator we have n c x minus 1 so by writing reciprocal we get this n minus x plus 1 factorial x minus 1 factorial divided by n factorial into p by q because it is obvious p power x divided by p power x minus 1 we get p q power n minus x divided by q power n minus x plus 1 you get q now simplify these two terms here here and n n factorial get cancelled and the numerator n minus x plus 1 factorial can be written as n minus x plus 1 into n minus x factorial into x minus 1 factorial divided by n minus x factorial into x into x minus 1 factorial because x factorial can be written like this so now you observe that n minus x factorial n minus x factorial cancel x minus 1 factorial x minus 1 factorial get cancelled the remaining terms are these terms n minus x plus 1 into p divided by x q by simplifying we get this by simplifying we get this but here we are adding x q we are subtracting x q to the numerator we are adding and subtracting x q to the numerator here you observe that so now let us simplify x q divided by x q 1 plus n plus 1 into p just we are rearranging the terms we are rearranging the terms n plus 1 into p minus x into p plus q what is p plus q here what is p plus q here p plus q is equals to 1 so p plus q is equals to 1 you simply get x n plus 1 into p minus x divided by x q so p of x divided by p of x minus 1 p of x divided by p of x minus 1 is equals to 1 plus n plus 1 into p minus x divided by x q. we know that mode is the value of x mode is the value of x for which p of x is minimum for which p of x is minimum and probability can take a maximum value one probability can take a maximum value one so what it means this term n plus one into p minus x divided by x q must be equivalent to zero you must you must note this point and remember that point mode is the value of x for which p of x is maximum and probability can be a maximum value 1. Probability can take a maximum value 1. So obviously this is 1 plus something. So this something must be equivalent to 0. It means n plus 1 into p minus x divided by x q is equals to 0. Again simplify. n plus 1 into p minus x is equals to 0. Which implies x is equals to n plus 1 into p. Yes, that is the mode. x is equals to mode is equals to n plus 1 into p this is the mode for binomial distribution let us see some two additional points here if n plus 1 into p is equals to m an integer if n plus 1 into p is equals to small m is an integer then there will be two modes one is m and the second one is m minus 1 in this case the binomial distribution is said to be bimodal said to be bimodal if n plus 1 into p is equals to m is not an integer then the mode will be integral part of m what is integral part suppose this is 2.3 
what is the integral part integral part of 2.3 2 integral part of 2.3 2 like that if n plus 1 into p is equals to m is not an integer then mode will be integral part of m mode will be integral part of m that's it 